Good afternoon. Welcome to Jim Munley's World of Weather. We clicked on to the Long Range Weather Forecast discussion for May 13th to 27th. First one gets something out of the way because it's local. Um, people across the Middle Atlantic and Northeast, particularly like around the New York City area, uh, experience a hazy look to the skies and it's not humidity. It's from, uh, you can see here from the, um, uh, Western Canada fire, uh, wildfires that bring the air here. This is at different levels. And this is the, um, which levels are these? I have the 500, the 300, and the 700 millibars up here um, displayed. And this is where the air is coming from. It's bringing the smoke in here. So um, that's one thing I wanted to talk about. Now we're going to get to the forecast. This is for the period May 13th to the 17th. And the flow doesn't really change all that much. You can see here we have a ridge that builds across Western North America above Noma Heights. And we have a trough that extends from below up near Greenland down into the Northeast. And the effects is what you see right now. You can see this is the airflow coming in and bringing the uh, smoke into higher levels of the atmosphere. Um, we're going to look at the surface. We're going to get a look. This is for, um, we will have a system and a weekend upper low and a surface low will continue to weaken through the weekend. And then, um, the, um, system will cause mod to heavy rain across portions of the upper Midwest. And then the trailing front of lower upper level energy can bring excessive rainfall here across, uh, parts of Texas. Now we're going to look at the, um, the five day outlook for um, the, this is the NSEP um, ERO. And here you see we have, um, it's just a slight, slight risk here. And then we have marginal risk here for heavy rain. Now we're going to look at the different models here in the rain. This is uh, over the weekend. You can see we have, um, this is GFS, uh, four or five inches of rain as its front stalls. And then uh, that's the GFS. Here's the uh, European, all showing heavy rainfall. And this is European ensembles. And um, this is showing rainfall amounts of uh, maybe three inches across here. But there's going to be more rain falling across this area uh, through the weekend. And then the building up a ridge that I just showed you in the west will cause above normal temperatures across the area and the trough will move into the east as we look at this uh, forecast period bring, bringing cooler temperatures to the northeast after our brief warm-up that we're expected to have. Okay, we're going to look at the period now for May 18th to 22nd. And the ridge builds across um, western North America above normal heights here. Here's our upper low. Now it's up over uh, near Hudson Bay, Northeast Canada, trough here. So the model's a good agreement. So for this forecast period, I'm calling for um, above normal temperatures here. And I'm forecasting anomaly to be as high as 15 degrees, especially across this area here. And uh, below normal temperatures for the northern middle Atlantic and the Northeast with the anomalies of 2 to 4 degrees below normal for precipitation. Call for below normal precipitation here, probability of occurrence near 35%. Above normal precipitation here, probability of occurrence 35 to 40%. Looking at the period now for uh, May 23rd to 27th, pattern is not as amplified as it was, but overall we still have our same general pattern above normal heights here across Western North America and most country. And we still have a little bit of a troughing here across um, the Northeast. So um, for this forecast period, I'm calling for above normal temperatures here. Calling for anomalies of up to 4 degrees above normal, below normal temperatures here. With anomalies near 4 degrees below normal. For precipitation, calling for uh, above no below normal precipitation here. Probability of 35%. And we have above normal precipitation across this area here. And the probability of occurrence is 35%.
or 35 to 40%. So if that's a long range weather forecast discussion for May 13th to the 27th, thanks for coming to Monley's World of Weather and have a good day.